Hi, this is Apple Watch Dave, and welcome to today's video on notes on the Apple Watch. Now, recently, Apple has put notes on the Apple Watch, which seems an unbelievable thing, really, that you think it would have been there for years, but it hasn't been. So in today's video, I'm going to show you how it works, how to set it up, and how to get the most out of it on your Apple Watch complications uh, control center, that kind of thing. Okay, so first up, here we have the neon green trail loop. If you're interested in that band, then have a look at my previous video reviewing that. Or if you're interested in any of these apps on this screen, have a look at one of my other previous videos where I go through the three apps that I use most every day. The one at the top, the one there, and the one there. Okay, right, let's have a look then at notes then. So first of all, the first thing you can do is you can just go on and you can open notes in an old school fashion. And there it is, okay? And it allows you to um, see the notes that are there and also write a new note, okay? So uh, in, uh, let's have a look then. So uh, try that. So in today's video, I'm going to be telling you all about notes on the Apple Watch. Full stop. And then I can save that and that will, <laughs> yeah, and then uh, that will become a new uh, note, okay? Uh, but I'm just going to delete that note because actually that's just a load of rubbish, isn't it? Yeah, delete the note. So that, it works, oh, thank you. It works just like it should do. So how do you get most out of it then? Well, first of all, you need to make sure you've got it set as a complication. So let's move on to this watch face on the Ultra because it's nice and easy to put different complications in. So I'm just going to get rid of my sleep score there. Um, and I'm going to whip up here to, uh, hang on, to notes. There it is. And you'll see you've got a few options for what you want to put on the watch face. Open notes, last edited note, or new note. Well, I'm actually going to put the last edited note in the middle complication. So today I'm going to put new note there. So you can see I've got that at the bottom. Then if it goes to the large complication, just remove carrot weather for a second. Obviously, it's raining again. Classic. And let's get down to notes. Here we are. And then what it'll do is last edit it. Now, I'll put that onto the watch face for you. So if you're really interested in notes, you can actually have that there, right there as a complication. Now, obviously, you can set reminders up, can't you, on the Apple Watch? And that works really, really well. But I like the idea, actually, if I had something to remember that I could have my last edited note actually written on the watch face to me. That seems to be a pretty smart tool. Now, I actually made this note on the um, on my iPhone. And you can see it says, look, subscribe to Apple Watch Dave Sound Advice. There's a little picture there where it's my writing that I've written the word hello. There you go. You can zoom in, zoom out on that if you want. So you've got that functionality. And then it gives you a number of options. Now, I've done them as a checklist, okay? So let's hope you have subscribed to Apple Watch Dave. I can just tick that off. And thanks to those of you who have, subscriptions are going up. Getting above 700 now, which when I started this about a month ago properly, I can't believe huge numbers of you have also liked the videos as well, which has been really helpful. Um, and also a lot of you have been commenting on them, saying what you found interesting, asking questions. And that's given me advice uh, for further videos. And uh, quite a number of you uh, actually watching to the end. And that's been pretty uh, pleasing for me personally. As I say, started this seriously about six weeks ago. Um, and in that time, there's been huge numbers of you watching the, uh, the content. So thank you very much for that. Um, one video is at 11,000, a couple at 5,000, 4,000, that kind of thing. Again, it's not setting the world alight, but it's given me enough encouragement to carry on with the channel. So I appreciate that for you. So you can see your notes right in there. So that's one option. But you might be saying to me, hang on a minute, Dave, I've got too many complications. I don't want to have notes on the complication. Well, what you can do, sorry, is you can actually edit the control center. So what you can do is go on to edit at the bottom here and you can see, look, I've actually got new note there. I'll just delete that for now. Let's have a look. So you go up to the top where the plus is there and it's got some options here and you can look through uh, and you can find notes here. Yeah, where are we? He says, there it is. All right. And then you can have new note and then you can obviously move it higher up if you want. So I'll just put it into second place, uh, just underneath mobile service and Wi-Fi there, and then go done, all right? So then that means you can quickly open up a new note from your control center, if that's what you want to do, and it'll crack on and start recording everything that you're saying. So it might be that that's the case, and that's something that you just really want to do, okay? There you go. Uh, let's have a, a little emoji in there. Yeah, okay, let's put an okay in there. Yeah, all right, and I keep talking, it keeps dictating it, and then it saves it there, as I say. So that functionality is there for you perfectly, all right? So what do you think about notes on the Apple Watch? It should have been there for years, if you ask me, but Apple has done it really well, I think, and they've focused on this element of how you would use it actually as a watch, rather than 
a knockoff of the iPhone complication. I really like it. I think it works seamlessly. Let me know if you do too, if you found it interesting and informative. Thanks very much. Bye.